watching Fox 16 News at 9. Covering Conway, Malvern, Little Rock, and all of Central Arkansas. It's been more than four decades since Ron Calcagney led Arkansas to an Orange Bowl victory. And as Cassandra Webb reports, it would take just as long for the Razorback quarterback to realize he had a heart condition called mitral valve prolapse. Ron Calcagney was a superstar on the gridiron. Look out, Calcagney, he gets away. He stayed active and healthy since then until a routine checkup revealed something surprising. And my primary care doctor said, did anybody ever tell you you have a, a, a heart murmur? And I go, what do you mean a heart murmur? His primary care physician referred him to Dr. Alex Orsini at Baptist Health. And I was very excited because Ron Calcagni was coming in. His heritage, being an Italian and I'm an Italian, we kind of hit it off. All was well until April of this year when Calcagni noticed shortness of breath during one of his usual workouts. Soon after, he began coughing and ended up in the emergency room. Turned out, his heart valve was leaking. We knew the valve needed to be operated on as fast as possible. Mitral valve prolapse is the most common valve abnormality in Americans. Most people do just fine, but in Calcagni's case, you have about a 90% or more chance of a complication or requiring surgery at some point in your life. Calcagni's surgery in April was a success, and he says he's feeling great. And I can go back to my normal life, I'm, you know, of doing the things that I was always doing. And Theoretically, we will never have to operate it again, and he will go on with his active lifestyle for decades. The former Razorback offering this advice to everyone. Be proactive in your health care. That is so important, proactive, and don't take it lightly. Very good point. And that was Cassandra Webb reporting. The most common symptom of mitral valve prolapse is shortness of breath. So if you start to experience this during regular activities, schedule a visit with your doctor.